this short video, we're going to look at setting up an FLR3100 or FLR3400 handheld radio with a Fuelite 3000 or 4500 series display system. Topics will include everything necessary to get the display functional, which includes syncing the remote, addressing display faces, and setting prices. The first step is to set a unique address on the FLR3100 handheld radio. This is done by setting the dip switches on the back to a unique setting. Next, turn the displays on. After a few seconds, press the plus and minus keys on line one of the remote simultaneously. The decimal point on the host display will then flash three times, indicating the remote is synced with the display. You have five minutes from the time power is applied to sync the remote. However, you can always reboot the displays if necessary. The next step is to address the displays. All fuel light displays are sent from the factory configured for line one and have default content of P11, which stands for price one, line one. Once the displays are installed, they will need to be addressed according to their position in the sign structure. This way, line one on the handheld radio changes all signs set to line one and so on. To begin, simultaneously press the plus and minus keys on line two until the decimal begins to flash. You'll also see one display pulsing. This is the display that is currently in addressing mode. Press the plus or minus keys on line two of the handheld until the correct line shows on the display face. To advance to the next display, simultaneously press the plus and minus buttons on line two again until the next display begins to flash. Repeat this process until all displays on the structure have been addressed appropriately. To exit the addressing mode at the end, press the plus and minus buttons on line two until the displays show the default content. Now that the displays have been addressed, you are ready to set the prices on your displays. To do this, press and hold any button for five seconds until the decimal begins to blink. Use the plus or minus buttons to change the price for the corresponding line number. Once all prices have been set, stop pressing buttons and the display will time out after about 10 seconds. Now your new FLR3100 or FLR3400 is ready to use with your Fuelite 3000 or 4500 series displays.